Yo, what is up, guys? It's Alberto here from After School Stories again. As you can tell by the title, this is a story about this time this kid brought in and got into school. But it wasn't like a real gun, it, but it was an airsoft gun, which is still considered a weapon, especially in school, right? So there's actually two stories about this kid. I'll start off with the first one, right? First one, we were in like kindergarten or something. This man pulled the fire alarm. Then he started running away from the teacher, and he like peed in the sink or something, he was just running away. So our teacher had to just get him, and this man just pulled the fire alarm. So to this day, we just know him as that kid who pulled the fire alarm, since he moved away like a year afterwards. And that's just what we know him as. And then like later, um, later in our school career, this man brings in an airsoft gun, and he's over there trying to, like, brag and show it off and everything. So he's showing it to a bunch of people, and you know not everybody's gonna be quiet about something like that, because like, that could really hurt somebody, you know? So he's over there, like, flaunting it around, and so I guess somebody told the teacher, right? So, we were just, like, all, all in class, right? Because I didn't even know about this, right? Because he only showed it to, like, some people. But somebody must have not liked it. So, like, we were just chilling in class. Like, it was a normal day, right? I mean, he was acting like himself. And then, the principal just walks down there. He opens the door. And he just takes the kid out of the class. And he leaves the book back there, right? But then, later... A bunch of more like people come in and they take the book bag I didn't even know who those people were back then so they take his book bag and we learned like later that week I think that he had a gun in there right I mean like people were saying it was like a real gun at first but we learned it was just an airsoft gun I do believe he got suspended for a long time for that and he didn't even get in trouble for the fire drill thing either which is pretty funny they just called his parents but he got suspended for this gun thing and I mean he he still lives near us but he moved away to a different school like he doesn't go to my high school and we don't really know much about him anymore so I hope he's doing well obviously you know hope he doesn't bring something else in the school so I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, make sure to leave a like. Sorry for how short this commentary was, I'm feeling really sick, so I'm sorry for not posting yesterday either. And if you want to hear more stories, make sure to subscribe. Alright guys, see ya, peace, have a great day.